in this video we are going to look at how to implement uploading rewarded video ads and rewarded display ads in your android app to get started i already have an android studio project set up and this one we set it up uh, in our first video if you want to look at it check the link in the description the full playlist so after uh, integrating the approving SDK, the next thing you do, go to your manifest and add the internet permission and add ID permission. Then also in your build.godo file, add the dependency for the play services ads identifier to fetch your advertising ID efficiently and this will help in your ECPMs. The next we have to create a rewarded ad unit id in our approving dashboard so come here on the sidebar go to max then add units and then create an ad unit i'm going to call it example rewarded ad then platform android and then choose the app for which you are creating this ad unit id this is it and the ad type is rewarded ad now scroll down and click save once the ad unit id is created now let's look at the mediation docs Click on the system we are targeting that's Android. Then here come to add formats, then rewarded. Now we have the two methods loading a rewarded ad and then showing a rewarded ad and then accessing the amount and currency for a rewarded ad. So let's get this da these data members here and add them to our main activity or any activity where you want to show the rewarded ad then I'm going to import this max rewarded ad class now I will have two buttons one to roll the rewarded ad and the other one to show the rewarded ad so I'm creating a button with and high to wrap content then i will center it in the center of the parent i'll give it a text i will call it load add and i'll give it an id so that i can find it in the java code so I call it btn load so I'm going to create another button to show the ad I call it and I give it the id btn show I give it the text show ad and then I center it horizontally and then I'll position it below the load add button okay since we have created these two buttons now let's create the data members for them in our java code private button I have load and show so we instantiate this uh, these two buttons here in the on create method so load go to find view by id then r dot id dot btn load then show find view by id r dot id dot show btn show
okay so don't mind about these errors that just it's just a problem with my android studio so the next thing i have to do is to set an on click listener for these two buttons so load set on click listener and i will use the uh, lambda function for simplicity so here i'm going to call a method but before that is first bring this code here for create rewarded add copy this and paste it outside of on create down here so you import these classes And then to remove these errors, we have to implement the max rewarded add listener here in our activity after the extends up compat activity. I'm going to add implements max rewarded add listener. This one. You see now the errors are gone. So let's bring our add unit ID here. Go to your approving dashboard and copy the rewarded add unit ID that we created and then come and paste it here okay now so when I click the load button I want to create the rewarded add so I call that method so after creating the rewarded add I will have come here to the on add rewarded listener and to be sure that the ad is loaded, I have to I will show a toast. Ad loaded. And when the ad loaded, that's when I will want to show it. So after that, I am going to set on, on key clicks enough for the show button. and i'll call a method show rewarded add and i'm going to create it here in our main activity so in this show rewarded add method i'm going to paste the code here this one Okay, we first check if the rewarded ad is ready, then we show it. Then, if you want to reward the user after they have watched the ad, here is the method to do it, and you can get the reward amount using this max reward object here, and you can get the amount of the reward using max reward dot get amount you can set this amount to any variable of your choice and use it appropriately in your app uh, one more thing to set the the reward for the user when they dismiss or finish watching the rewarded ad go to your app proving dashboard then app discovery applications so to set the reward amount remotely here on uh applications select the app for which you are setting this rewarded amount in case in my case it is this one and then here enter the reward amount of your choice okay now since our app is ready let's build and run and see if it works or not
so the app is launched i'm going to click on load ad let's see my toast ad loaded then i can show the ad now okay so the rewarded ad is showing and this is all you need to do so we are seeing a test ad and if you want to get real ads you just use a device that you did not set as a test device or add your device as a test device and then you pause it in the uploading dashboard so this is all about rewarded uploading ads goodbye see you in the next video